Hello, I am testing. 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 Yeah, if you're in match number two, go ahead and go to the queuing area as well.
All right, let's meet our teams for match number one. Over on the Red Alliance from Newcastle, Oklahoma, we have team 7366, the Lab Rats. And joining them over on the Red Alliance from Bridge Creek High School in Blanchard, Oklahoma, we have Beast, Team 7242 BC Robocat. <laughs> over on the Blue Alliance, also from Newcastle, Oklahoma, we have Team. <laughs> That's been happening. That's going to continue to happen. Don't worry about it. Um, we have Team 13049, the Prototypes. And joining them on the Blue Alliance from Shawnee, Oklahoma, it's Team 10641 Atomic Gears. <laughs> All right, let's get everything ready. We're already randomized? We're good to go. All right, let's get this match going in three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, Atomic Gears moving forward, flipping around. Oh, all the robots moving. It looks like one high goal for Atomic Gears. Uh, one, two high goals for the prototypes. A couple of shots fired over here on the Red Alliance. Wow, a lot going on in this autonomous mode. There's a couple of wobble goals over in the blue zone. Whoa, a little collision there. We got one wobble goal in the red zone. And that Driver, is autonomous. pick up your controllers. Three. Two, one. All right, we got robots moving. Atomic Gears getting those rings. Lab Rats getting some rings. Prototypes getting rings. Robocats putting some rings into the logo. We have a couple of shots being fired on the Blue Alliance there from Atomic Gears in the high goal. We got one mid goal over here for the Blue Alliance. And it looks like teams are picking up those rings, shooting them into the high goal. We got one over here for the Red Alliance. And some more high goals. None of them make it. There's one from Atomic Gears. Wow. There's a lot of shots being fired. A lot of shots not making it in, though. 56 seconds on the clock. Prototypes with shot there, not quite making it in. Wow, a couple of shots over here. Also not quite making it in. One, two, three high goals over there on the Blue Alliance. Atomic Gears. Lab Rats coming in a little hot. <laughs> it's now the in-game period. Atomic Gears going after that blue wobble goal. Lab Rats going after the red wobble goal. Robocats waiting patiently. Prototypes trying to get their claw working. That's one power shot for the Blue Alliance. Atomic Gears, two power shots for the Blue Alliance. the match.
please make sure that you check your robots to make sure you do not take any rings with you. This has been an issue at the last couple of events. We have scores. It's a Blue Alliance victory, 26 to 176. All right, let's get robots on the field for match number two. All right, let's meet our teams for match number two. Over on the Red Alliance, we have Team 6735, Team Medusa. And joining them, we have Team 7506 from Frederick, Oklahoma, System Overload. Over on the Blue Alliance from Newcastle, Oklahoma, we have Team 4378 Black Box Robotics. <laughs> and also on the Blue Alliance from Millwood High School in Oklahoma City, we have Team 15657 Millwood Robotics. <laughs> All right, is everybody ready? All right, let's get this match going in three, two, one, go! All right, we got one shot fired, two, three shots fired. Nothing quite making it in. We got one Red Alliance thing in the right place, wobble goal. Looked like several uh, high goals over there for the Blue Alliance. I couldn't tell how many. There's one blue wobble goal in the zone and one red wobble goal in the zone. And four robots, oh, three robots on the line. One second remaining. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, it's still anyone's game coming out of Autonomous. Let's see how the 
robots perform. Black Box coming over and knocking over that stack. Medusa getting lined up to shoot. And there's one high goal, two high goals, and a mid goal for the Blue Alliance. And a bunch of shots getting fired. Only one high goal making it in. Actually, a second one for Medusa. And a mid goal for the Red Alliance. That is system overload. Couple more high goals over here for Team Medusa. Millwood Robotics getting lined up on that wobble goal so that they can score it in in game. Three more high goals over here for Team Medusa. Another mid goal for System Overload. And a low goal scored for the other alliance, the Blue Alliance. Two high goals for Medusa. And Black Box firing at that high goal, not quite making it. Another mid goal for System Overload for the Red Alliance. 32 seconds remaining. And it is now the in-game period. We've got System Overload with that red wobble goal, Millwood Robotics with their blue wobble goal, trying to get that over the wall. And System Overload going after a red wobble goal. Oh, Millwood not quite making that blue wobble goal. Hopefully they can try again. And that is the match. Make sure you check your robots for rings. All right, we have some scores. A Red Alliance victory, 60 to 195. Getting close to 200 already. Please hold, we have a uh, field issue that we are getting resolved. Shouldn't take too long.
All right, robots onto the field for match number three. Let's meet our teams for match number three over on the Red Alliance from Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. We have team 12535, Revolutionary Robots. Yeah. 
And then joining them over on the Red Alliance from uh, Epic Charter Schools in Edmond, Oklahoma, we have Team 18333 Void Elements. Yeah. Over on the Blue Alliance from Sh North Rock Creek School in Shawnee, Oklahoma, we have Team 16426 Absolute Zero. And joining them on the Blue Alliance from Merritt High School in Elk City, Oklahoma, we have Team 11344 Merritt Oilers. All right, looks like we're randomized and ready to go. Is everybody ready? Let's get this match going in three, two, one, go! All right, we got robots moving forward slowly. We got Void Elements pushing their wobble goal onto the line. We got Revolutionary Robots <laughs> putting their uh, wobble goal into the correct zone. And Absolute Zero with their wobble goal in the correct zone. <laughs> we got some rings getting shot uh, at the Alliance partner. And that's autonomous. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, we got Robots in Motion, Revolutionary Robots, and Absolute Zero getting lined up to shoot. And Void Elements seem to have a ring stuck on top of their robot, unfortunately. Revolutionary Robots getting lined up to shoot. A couple of shots from uh, Absolute Zero, didn't quite make it. And a couple of high goals for Revolutionary Robots. Looks like uh, Absolute Zero is getting ready to grab that wobble goal for in-game. Revolutionary Robots shooting those rings. They're going through the back of the, <laughs> the back of the fields. It's a little bit of a janky field this year, having some issues so far. Revolutionary Robots look like they are going after more rings. Void elements, possibly getting some rings as well. Man, these rings are really flying out of the back of this. I don't think they're supposed to do that. <laughs> yeah, I still don't know. I don't know. Talk to Whoa. All right. <laughs> It is now the in-game period. And Revolutionary Robots and uh, Absolute Zero going after those wobble goals. And Revolutionary Robots getting both of those wobble goals really quickly. Are they going to go after some power shots? That's one red power shot. Oof. Two seconds remaining. And that's the match. You guys are good to take them away. We have scores. A Red Alliance victory, 40 to 113.
Let's get robots on the field for match number four. All right, let's meet our teams for match number four. Over on the Red Alliance, we have team 7366, the Lab Rats. <laughs> and joining them on the Red Alliance from Steampost 26 in Tulsa, we have team 14906, Leviathan. <laughs> Over on the Blue Alliance from, we already know where you guys are from. Wait, did that earlier. Uh, it's Team 7242 BC RoboCat. <laughs> and then joining them on the Blue Alliance from Newcastle, Oklahoma, it's Team 6735 Team Medusa. <laughs> All right, are we randomized and ready to go? Everybody ready? Let's get this going in three, two, one, go! <laughs> All right, Team Medusa going out around that wobble goal. Leviathan delivering their wobble goal into the correct zone. Lab Rats making a high goal for the Red Alliance and a second high goal for the Red Alliance. Two mid goals for the Blue Alliance from Leviathan and a third high goal for the Red Alliance and a second wobble goal in the correct zone. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. Let's go. Let's go. Leviathan, Lab Rats, and Medusa all going after those rings. Looks like RoboCats might be having an issue with their robot. But we got an FTA on the job. Couple of shots, not quite making it for the Lab Rats. Leviathan getting lined up to shoot. Team Medusa getting some more rings. Lab Rats doing the same. And a high goal from Leviathan. And a mid goal for the Blue Alliance from Leviathan. That's a high goal. And another high goal for Team Medusa. And a mid goal also from Team Medusa. That's three high goals from the Lab Rats. And three high goals from Medusa. And we have 53 seconds remaining. Leviathan going ahead and grabbing that wobble goal. Another high goal for the Lab Rats.
Lab Rats getting some more rings. Medusa getting some more rings. Lab Rats coming over <laughs> to come pick up their Wobble Goal. And RoboCats are up and working for the end game. That's two, three power shots from the Team Medusa on the Blue Alliance. Two Wobble Goals for the Red Alliance from Lab Rats and Leviathan. And RoboCats going after their Wobble Goal. Six seconds remaining. Medusa going after some more high goals, and they got one. And that is the match. Got that wobble goal for the Blue Alliance right on the buzzer. And we have scores. A Blue Alliance victory, 151 to 140. Very close, Matt. Would have been even closer without that 10 point penalty. All right, let's get more robots on the field for match number five. Over in match number five on the Red Alliance, we have Team 7506 System Overload. <laughs> and also on the Red Alliance, we have Team 13049, the Prototypes. <laughs> Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 16426, Absolute Zero. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. Revolution. Yeah, all right, are we all randomized and ready to go? Let's get going then in three, 
two, one, go! Alright, we got robots in motion. And that is a wobble goal delivered to the correct zone from system overload. There's three high goals there from the prototypes and <laughs> a very forceful wobble goal replacing the other one that was so elegant, uh, elegantly placed. And a mid goal for the Red Alliance, unfortunately. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. Revolutionary robots going after those rings. We've got system overload picking up a wobble goal that they can carry around. Two mid goals there from 16-4-26. And more mid goals over there on the Red Alliance for system overload. Three high goals. Very quick secession there from Revolutionary Robots. Prototypes getting some more rings, getting ready to shoot. Two more high goals for the Blue Alliance. There's a high goal for the Red Alliance from the prototypes. And another high goal, two more high goals for the Blue Alliance. 48 seconds remaining, Blue Alliance in the lead. That's another Red Alliance mid goal from System Overload. And it's now the in-game period. System Overload going for that red wobble goal. They got it. One power shot for Revolutionary Robots. Two power shots for Revolutionary Robots. Absolute zero going after that blue wobble goal. And a third power shot for the Blue Alliance. Revolutionary Robots going after that second blue wobble goal. Five seconds remaining and they've got it. Prototypes going after their red wobble goal. And they've got it. And that is the match. A very good in-game there for the Blue Alliance especially. Scores for match number five. A Blue Alliance victory, 171 to 115. All right, let's get robots on the field. For match number six.
All right, let's meet our teams in match number six. Over on the Red Alliance, we have team 10641 Atomic Gear. Yeah. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have team 15657 Millwood Robotics. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have team 14906 Leviathan. All right. Also on the Blue Alliance, we have team 18333 Void Elements. All right. Are we all randomized and ready to go? Uh, I don't think we are. All right. Have we randomized? We have. All right. Is everybody ready? Let's get going in three, two, one, go! All right. We got all four robots moving forward. Atomic Gear shooting three high goals and qu very quickly. We got Leviathan with one high goal and one mid goal. And Atomic Gear is placing their uh, wobble goal into the correct zone. Leviathan placing their wobble goal into the correct zone. Atomic Gear is picking up another ring there. Shooting it. Picking up two more rings. And two more high goals. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right. It is now the driver controlled period. Atomic Gears going after those rings. Leviathan going after some rings. And one more high goal from Atomic Gears. Leviathan trying to get unstuck from on top of a ring there. Three more high goals from Atomic Gears. And a low goal from Void Elements. Leviathan with a high goal. Atomic Gears with two high goals. And it looks like Atomic Gears, three more high goals. Leviathan getting some more rings as well. Three more high goals for Atomic Gears. Two more high goals for Leviathan. Void Elements getting lined up to shoot in the mid goal. And they got one. Atomic Gears with two more high goals. Leviathan getting lined up to shoot as well. And it is now the in-game period. Atomic Gears trying to get a hold of their wobble goal. Leviathan trying to get a hold of their wobble goal. Millwood Robotics has their red wobble goal. They're trying to get that. Atomic Gears going after some more high goals. Leviathan scores the blue wobble goal outside the field. Leviathan going after a second wobble goal. Five seconds remaining. Millwood Robotics trying to get that wobble goal. Not quite getting it. That is the match. A Red Alliance victory, 89 to 204. A new high score for today.
All right, let's get more robots onto the field. Let's meet our teams for match number seven. 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 Yeah. On the Red Alliance, we have team 11-344 Merritt Oilers. And also on the Red Alliance, we have team 12-535 Revolutionary Robots. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have team 4378 Black Box Robotics. And also on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 7366, the Lab Rats. Our first Newcastle Alliance of the day. All right, are we randomized? Yep. All right, a lot of four rings today. Let's get this match going in three, two, one, go! <laughs> All right, Black Box moving forward there. Lab Rats moving forward. Revolutionary robots moving sideways. And we have a bunch of rings getting fired on the Blue Alliance. Unfortunately, none of them make it in. There's a wobble goal in the red side in the correct zone. One high goal for the Blue Alliance. One power shot for the Red Alliance. It doesn't look like any of those blue wobble goals made it in. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, Red Alliance with a slight lead out of Autonomous, but it's still anyone's game. Revolutionary Robots getting ready to shoot. 
And we got three high goals from Revolutionary Robots. Lab Rats lining up to shoot those mid goals. They got one, and it looked like maybe a low goal. It's hard to tell. Revolutionary Robots going after some more rings. Black Box going after those high goals. Two high goals for the Blue Alliance. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. And there's one high goal for the Red Alliance. Maybe a couple for the Blue Alliance. It's very hard to keep up with everything going on. Man, some aggressive collisions there. One red high goal, two red high goals. And it looks like we've got a couple of teams with some connection issues. Hopefully they can get that sorted out. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. Revolutionary Robots <laughs> is now the in-game period. One blue power shot has already been fired. A second blue power shot. And Revolutionary Robots, Lab Rats going after those uh, wobble goals. We've got the Merit Oilers with the red wobble goal as well. Four seconds remaining. And that is the match. Careful. And we have scores. A Blue Alliance victory. 130 to 115. Let's get some robots on the field for match number eight.
There we go, that's the fifth time. It will continue happening, just to keep you on your toes. All right, let's meet our teams in match number eight. Over on the Red Alliance, we have team 6735, Team Medusa. And also on the Red Alliance, we have team 16426, Absolute Zero. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have team 10641, of the Atomic Gears. And also on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 14906, Leviathan. All right. Is everybody randomized? Everything, everything ready to go? All right, let's get this match going in three. Wait, what? In three, two, one, go. All right, we got robots moving forward. One high goal from Medusa, uh, one high goal for the Blue Alliance, and a mid goal for the Blue Alliance. Atomic Gears and Leviathan both placing their wobble goals in the zone. 10 seconds remaining in Autonomous. And Leviathan is moving over. And that is... Driver, pick up your controllers. Three. Two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. Team Medusa coming up to the feeder station. We got Absolute Zero placing their wobble goal, getting ready for in-game, making sure the wobble goals are across the line. Atomic uh, Gears with some high goals. <laughs> we got Team Medusa with a couple of high goals as well. Leviathan scoring a mid goal for the Red Alliance. Three high goals for Atomic Gears and two high goals for Team Medusa. Leviathan getting lined up to shoot. Atomic Gears getting lined up to shoot as well. Leviathan with two high goals. Team Medusa with a high goal. A couple of mid goals there for the Blue Alliance. Atomic Gears shooting a couple, not quite making it. Team Medusa shooting a couple. And they made the last one, high goal. High goal for the Blue Alliance as well. 40 seconds remaining. Leviathan going after that wobble goal so that they can Prepare for in-game. <laughs> and it's now the in-game period. The Blue Alliance rushing over and scoring those wobble goals very quickly. Absolute zero with their wobble goal for the Red Alliance. Atomic Gears going after those power shots. Shooting a little high, they got one. 11 seconds remaining. Leviathan getting lined up to shoot as well. Two power shots for the Blue Alliance. And that is the match.
a Blue Alliance victory, 183 to 134. All right, let's meet the teams for match number nine. We're on a new page now. All right, over on the Red Alliance, we have team 11344, the Merritt Oilers. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have team 4378, Black Box Robotics. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 13049, the Prototypes. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 15657, Millwood Robotics. All right, are we randomized? Are we ready? All right, let's do it in three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, we got robots moving. Blackbots and Millwood moving forward. Prototypes going up against the wall. Three high goals from Blackbox. Very quick. And a wobble goal in the correct zone. We got three high goals as well from Prototypes and a wobble goal in the correct zone. Two very similar autonomous modes. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, I think we saw from Autonomous that this is going to be a pretty evenly matched match. So we will see. It could go either way. Black box and prototypes going after those rings. Millwood Robotics making sure they get that wobble goal across the line. There's one high goal for the Red Alliance and a couple for the Blue Alliance. And we've got the Merritt Oilers moving their wobble goal forward as well. Three rapid fire high goals there for Black Box. Prototypes with a high goal and a second high goal. Black Box with two high goals. We've got one minute remaining in the match. Black Box getting lined up to shoot. Prototypes getting lined up to shoot. And a couple high goals from each of them.
Three high goals for Black Fox. Rapid fire there. Prototypes getting lined up to shoot as well. One, two high goals. It's now the in-game period. Black Fox going after those power shots. Millwood Robotics and Prototypes going after those wobble goals. And Prototypes have scored their wobble goal. And, ooh, Millwood almost got it. We got the Merritt Oilers over here going after a red wobble goal. We got one, two red power shots scored. Three before the buzzer. And that is the match. All right. Very cool. Leave any rings, fine. We have scores a Red Alliance victory, a one eleven to one forty one. Let's get robots on the field for match number 10. All right, very cool. On the Red Alliance in match number 10, we have team 7242 BC Robocats. Also on the Red Alliance, we have team 18333 Void Elements. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have team 7506 System Overload. And also on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 7366, the Lab Rats. <laughs> All right. We are randomized. Is everybody ready? Let's get this match going in three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right. We
we got robots in motion. Void elements placing their wobble goal in the incorrect zone. We got one. Oh, did we get a power shot? No power shots, unfortunately. Very close. And we got one wobble goal in the correct zone for the Red Alliance, and one mostly in the correct zone for the Blue Alliance. I can't tell if that's in or not from here. Driver, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, it is now the driver controlled period. Red Alliance with a slight lead going into the teleop period. One high goal for the Red Alliance. And a mid goal for the Blue Alliance, scored by the Red Alliance. And we got one high goal for each alliance there. And a mid goal for the blue alliance, void elements. And a high goal for the blue alliance. Two more high goals for the blue alliance. 54 seconds remaining. All right, we, it is almost the in-game period. And Lab Rats getting ready. Unfortunately, they're not going to be able to score that. Void Elements. Oh. We got System Overload and RoboCats going after their Wobble Goals. We got one blue power shot. We got two blue power shots. We got three blue power shots. Good job. Good Scores a Red Alliance victory. Man, that is brutal penalty wise. 60 points of penalties on the Blue Alliance. Robots to the field for match number 11. Wait, 11? Yeah, 11.
let's meet our teams for match number 11. Over on the Red Alliance, our second Newcastle Alliance of the day, we got team 6735, Team Medusa. And joining them, we have Team 4378, Black Box. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 10641, Atomic Gears. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 16426, Absolute Zero. All right, looks like we are randomized and ready to go. Let's get going in three, two, one, go. All right. Oh. We've got robots moving forward. It looks like the clock is working even though there was no time or the no sound. Uh, that's okay. And we got a bunch of power, or a bunch of high goals scored for both alliances. Seven seconds left in autonomous. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. Ding, 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 ding. Go, go. I don't know why there's no sound. I'll do the sound for you guys. Uh, we've got robots moving. Atomic Gears picking up some rings. We got Black Box shooting a ring outside the field. We got a couple of high goals going up. And another high goal for the Blue Alliance. A minute 30 seconds remaining. Three high goals there for the Red Alliance. Two more high goals for the Red Alliance. There's a lot of high goals going in there. And according to the scoring, we have a, an alliance already over 100 points, which is amazing. We got one mid goal scored there accidentally. One minute remaining. We got robots going after those rings. Forty, forty-four seconds remaining. It's just a race to see who can shoot the most high goals. Woo! It's now the end game period. And we got one mid goal or one one power shot scored there for the Red Alliance. We got wobble goals going over the wall. Fifteen seconds remaining. One blue power shot, one more red power shot. One more blue power shot. The match is over. Hopefully we can get the sound fixed by the next the next match. I'm I'm glad I'm glad I'm glad. We have scores.
Red Alliance victory, 112 to 174. All right, let's get some robots on the field for match number 12. Match number 12. All right, let's meet our teams for match number 12. Over on the Red Alliance, we have Team 15657, Millwood Robotics. Also on the Red Alliance, we have Team 11344, Merrick Oilers. That sounds like we have sound. That's very good, we didn't have sound last match. Uh, over on the Blue Alliance, if I had to nominate an alliance for best dressed alliance, it would be these guys. Uh, over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 7242 BC RoboCat. <laughs> and joining them, we have Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. <laughs> All right. And looks like we are randomized and ready to go. Hopefully we have sound this time. Wait, we're waiting. We're going to do a test, maybe. All right, we're going to try it. We will see. You ready? Three, two, one, go! We have sound. That was definitely sound. We got Millwood Robotics putting their wobble goal into the zone. We got another wobble goal in the zone for revolutionary robots. We got one red power shot. <laughs> Accidentally scored by the Blue Alliance. We got a second wobble goal in the correct zone for the Blue Alliance. Four seconds remaining in the autonomous period. Driver, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. A lot of rings going out onto the field. Revolutionary robots going after some of those rings. Looks like a couple of high goals there for the Blue Alliance. Robocats scoring a mid goal. Robocats. Coming over to the Red Alliance side of the field to intentionally score some mid goals. We've got a couple of high goals over there for the Blue Alliance. A minute and 10 seconds remaining. Two more mid goals for the Blue Alliance and the RoboCats. Looks like the Merritt Oilers are up and running. 
We got three more mid goals for the Robocats in the Blue Alliance. And a couple more high goals for Revolutionary Robots. And a high goal for the Red Alliance. And five seconds to end game. It is now the in game period. Millwood Robotics going after that wobble goal. One blue power shot has been scored. Robocats going after their wobble goal. Not quite able to get it. It's fell on top of their robot. Hopefully they can work that out. 10 seconds remaining. Revolutionary Robots with their wobble goal. And a another blue power shot scored at the last minute. And that was the match. We have scores. A Blue Alliance victory, 156 to 48. If you just played this match, please check your robot. Oh, never mind. Ignore me. All right, let's get robots on the field. All right, oh. let's meet our teams for match number 13. Over on the Red Alliance, we have team. 
13049 prototypes. Yeah. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have Team 14906 Leviathan. Okay. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 18333 Void Elements. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 7506 System Overload. All right, looks like we are randomized and ready to go. Let's get this match started in three, two, one, go. All right, we got robots in motion. Leviathan placing their wobble goal in the correct zone. Prototypes getting lined up to shoot. They've shot a couple of high goals. We got a second wobble goal in the red zone. And that looks like it might be it for Autonomous. Five seconds remaining. Oh, Leviathan moving forward. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. Leviathan getting some rings into their robot. Looks like system overload getting lined up to grab that wobble goal and bring it across the line so that they can score it in in-game. Or, yeah, just pick it up and carry it around. All right, it seems like the prototypes are having some connection issues, unfortunately. And system overload going back after that wobble goal. A minute and seven seconds remaining. Leviathan getting lined up to shoot. That's one, two, three high goals for Leviathan and the Red Alliance. And Void Element working on shooting as well. 43 seconds remaining. Getting close to the end game period. Leviathan getting lined up to pick up that wobble goal. And Void Element, er, uh, the we've got System Overload and Leviathan going after those wobble goals. Leviathan having some issues getting it over the wall. System Overload placing theirs across the wall. And Leviathan placing theirs for the Red Alliance. System, over, system Overload going after their second one. Leviathan going to pick up their second one. Eight seconds remaining. System Overload's got it for the Blue Alliance. And Leviathan's got it for the Red Alliance. And that is the match. We have scores. A Red Alliance victory, 57 to 117. Let's get some robots on the field. We're, we're ready. We have match, match 14, match 14 to the field.
we are missing, oh, never mind, they're here. All right, let's meet our teams in match number 14. Over on the Red Alliance, we have team 15657 Millwood Robotics. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have team 16426 Absolute Zero. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have team 11 344 Merritt Oilers. And joining them, we have Team 7366, the Lab Rats. All right. Looks like we are randomized, ready to go. All right, let's get this match going in three, two, one, go. All right, we got. Millwood Robotics moving forward and placing that wobble goal into the zone. And we got Lab Rats shooting at the goal. Not quite making it. And one high goal for the Lab Rats. Seven seconds remaining in the autonomous period. Lab Rats letting go of their wobble goal. All right, Lab Rats is up and running. Whoa, there's some gear crunching going on over there. Absolute Zero is getting lined up to shoot. Lab Rats doing a little dance over there or something. They're getting their wobble goal s across the line so they can score that in in-game. We got one high goal from Absolute Zero, and a second high goal from Absolute Zero. Now Absolute Zero is going after those wobble goals. Lab Rats with one high goal for the Blue Alliance. Absolute Zero picking up that wobble goal, bringing it across. And with one minute remaining, it looks like the Red Alliance is just going to wait until end game so they can score. They're getting their wobble goals picked up and ready. Lab Rats still going after those rings. And it looks like Lab Rats just got a high goal. They're picking up some more rings for their robot. And it is now the in-game period. Millwood Robotics getting their wobble goal. Lab Rats with one blue wobble goal. Lab Rats going after a second wobble goal with 10 seconds remaining. Oof, Millwood Robotics not quite getting that wobble goal up. And that is the match.
think we can go ahead and get some teams on the field for match number 15. And we have scores for match number 14. A Blue Alliance victory, 37 to two. Those penalty points will get you. Ingrid, this is the third time today. This is the fourth time today. Magic is real. All right. Let's meet our teams for match number 15. I'm going to go ahead and predict now that this will be a pretty high scoring match. Over on the Red Alliance, we have Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have Team 13049, the Prototypes. Okay. All right. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 10641 Atomic Gears. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 6735 Team Medusa. All right. It looks like we are randomized and ready to go. Let's get this match started in three, two, one, go! All right. Blue Alliance rushing forward. Team Medusa going after those power shots. A lot of things flying through the air over there. Looked like only one power shot scored. We got one red high goal, one blue mid goal. We got one wobble goal in. We got a red power shot. And some rings flying around. A lot of projectiles fired, not a lot made it. Drivers, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right, starting the match with four robots on the line. It is a slight red lead, but it's still anyone's game. Atomic Gears picking their wobble goal back up. Prototypes pushing their wobble goal across the line. And that is one, two power shots for Revolutionary Robots. And one, two, three power shot, or high goals for Atomic Gears. That's three high goals for Revolutionary Robots. Prototypes working on the, getting those wobble goals in a place where they can score them later on. There's one high goal for the Blue Alliance, three high goals for the Red Alliance. Team Medusa with a high goal there for the Blue Alliance. 
Three more high goals for the Blue Alliance and two more high goals for the Red Alliance. Prototypes getting lined up to shoot. Medusa getting lined up to shoot. That's one high goal for the Red Alliance. 40 seconds remaining. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. Two high goals for the Blue Alliance. And a third. And it's now in game. Prototypes going after that red wobble goal. Atomic Gear is going after the blue one. We got one red power shot fired, two red power shots fired. That blue power shot was not reset. One th that's three power shots for the Red Alliance. Two blue wobble goals, one red wobble goal. And that is the match. We have scores. A Red Alliance victory, 161 to 214, and a new high score for the day. Let's get robots on the field for match number 16. Let's meet our teams for match number 16. Over on the Red Alliance, we have team 14906, Leviathan. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have team 7242, BC Robocats. Over on the Blue Alliance, 
We have team 18333 Void Elements. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have team 4378 Black Box Robotics. All right, it looks like we are randomized and ready to go. Let's get this match going in three, two, one, go! All right, Black Box and Void Element moving forward. Leviathan placing their wobble goal into the zone. And we got a lot of things flying there. One high goal for the Blue Alliance. And we got, ooh. A little bit of a collision there. Robocats are on the line. Six seconds remaining. Leviathan moving over to shoot. Or they are on the line. Driver, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right, it is now the driver controlled period. Looks like Void Elements is coming over to the red side of the field to go after those mid goals. Leviathan getting lined up to shoot for the high goals. That's one high goal for Leviathan, two high goals for Black Box, one mid goal for the Blue Alliance and Void Elements, a second mid goal for Void Elements. Wow, we got a bunch of things flying over there. One mid goal scored for the Red Alliance, BC Robocats. Minute, 15 seconds remaining on the clock. Several shots bouncing off over on the blue side of the field. Void Elements getting lined up to shoot another mid goal. And that's a mid goal for each Alliance there. And that's two high goals for the Blue Alliance and Black Box. Very close match. Leviathan getting lined up for that wobble goal. 43 seconds remaining. And it is now the in-game period. Leviathan scoring the first wobble goal of the match. Robocats going after a second wobble goal for the Red Alliance. One blue power shot scored. Robocats still trying to get that wobble goal. It's wobbling a little bit too much. And they got it. Whoa. I spoke too soon. Black Box getting lined up to shoot. And a second power shot for the Blue Alliance and Black Box. And that is the match. And we have scores. A Blue Alliance victory, 90 to 59. We are missing two rings. Please check your robot if you just played this match to see if you stole some rings. Hey, there they are. All right, let's get our last qualification match of the day on the field.
in our our final qualification match for the day on the Red Alliance, we have Team 7506 System Overload. And joining them, we have Team 10641 Atomic Gears. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 6735 Team Medusa. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 11344, the Merritt Oilers. <laughs> Ingrid, you need to watch where you're walking. <laughs> All right, is everybody ready to get started? Let's get going in three, two, one, go. Oh, no sound for this one again, so I will have to do the sounds uh, once again. Two high goals for the Red Alliance, and another one. And we got one wobble goal in the correct zone for the Red Alliance. 11 seconds remaining. Ding, ding, ding. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. Go! All right, we got robots in motion. And we've got system overload picking up their wobble goal. And atomic gears picking up their rings, getting ready to shoot. That's two high goals for the Red Alliance and atomic gears. There's some gear crunching going on over there. Three high goals for Atomic Gears. We got one mid goal over there for the Red Alliance and the system overload. Team Medusa getting those rings, getting ready to go. Atomic Gears with two more high goals. Team Medusa with three high goals. One minute remaining. We've got a little bit of a collision going on over there, but it looks like it got resolved. Two high goals, four atomic gears, one high goal for Team Medusa. have the actual sound. It is now the in-game period, and we've got one wobble goal over the edge. We got a power shot scored for the Blue Alliance. System overload going after that second power shot for the Red Alliance. Atomic Gear is going after those power shots, and they get one. Two seconds remaining. And that is a match. All right, we have scores. A Red Alliance victory, 60 to 155.
We will, we will have the ranking sheets available here very soon. We will tell you when those are available. And then we will be meeting back up for alliance selection. I would like to see one representative from each team to get their team ranking sheet. One representative from each team. Please come to the field and get your ranking sheet. Thank you.
Are we, let's say we meet back up at 345 for our alliance selection. Works for me. Is that good with everyone? 345. So be here with a team representative at 340, just so we can get going.
All right. Go ahead and start sending your representatives from your teams up here so that we can get started. Hello. That's so annoying. I, I, I it's just it's All right, please send a representative from your team. We're gonna get started with alliance selection very soon. Hello, yeah, get in team number order. You guys are 70, wait. Yeah, you're right after them, I think. Oh wait, yeah, other way around. Hello, we're going to end team. Missing two people. What team are you? Okay, uh, you're gonna be. We're supposed to be a team number one. Uh, you should be right before lab rep. I think. All right, and we're missing. The Oilers, Merritt Oilers. We are missing a representative from Merritt Oilers. We need one representative from Merritt Oilers to report to the front right here. Does anybody know where their pit is? Can anybody go get them?
Yeah. We need a representative from Merritt Oilers. All right, well, I guess we can go ahead and get started. Hello, welcome. I'm uh, glad you guys are all here. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, let's get a round of applause for the matches today. And I'm going to kind of assume you guys know how alliance selection works already, uh, but basically the top four teams are going to select alliance partners for the semifinals. So um, we're going to go ahead and get started by bringing up our fourth place, uh, fourth seated alliance captain, which is going to be 14906 Leviathan Robotics. <laughs> Come and stand at the number four, Wobble Goal. And up next, we have our number three seated alliance captain, which is going to be Team 4378, Black Box Robotics. Right yep, come stand next to the three wobble goal. Now, on our number two seated alliance, we have Team, uh, team 63, 6735, Team Medusa. And our number one seated alliance captain will be Team 10641 Atomic Gears. So I'm going to somewhat assume that all of the invitations are gracious and all of the acceptances are gracious. And I'm just gonna have you guys say the team name or number into the microphone and don't say anything else, okay? Just because of COVID. I uh, don't want everybody talking into the same microphone. So, um, all right, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, 10641 Atomic Gears, who would you like to invite to be your alliance partner? Revolutionary Robotics. All right. That is Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. Do you accept? We would love to start a revolutionary movement. Heck yeah. We have our number one alliance right there. All right, moving on down to the number two seated alliance, Team 6735 Medusa, who would you like to invite? Black Box Robotics. All right, and that's Team 4378 Black Box Robotics. Do you accept? All right, go ahead and move up. And what that means is that we, oh, let's give a round of applause for our number two seated alliance. Up next, our number three seated alliance moves up to the number four or to the, to the number, moves up from four to three, and then, da -da -da -da, new challenger approaches. Uh, we have team 7506 system overload is our new number four seated alliance. All right, team 14906 Leviathan, who would you like to invite? We'd love to release the Kraken with lab rats. Lab rats, that is 7366 lab rats. Do you accept? All right. That's our number three seated alliance. And moving on down to the number four seated alliance, uh, Team 7506 System Overload, who would you like to invite? Team 7506 would like to invite the prototypes. The prototypes, that's Team 13049. The prototypes, do you accept? Yes. All right. These are our alliances for the semifinals. Uh, please prepare yourselves. Uh, and very shortly, uh, let's say at 3.55, so four minutes from now, let's get number one and number four on the field. And you guys in queuing. And break. Get to it.
All right, let's get robots on the field for semifinal one, match number one. Now at Bishop Kelly last week, one of our semifinals got to a match number four. So let's hope that doesn't happen today. <laughs> Yes, that does mean they tied a match. All right, are you guys ready to meet the teams for semifinal uh, number one? Yeah. yeah, all right, yeah, we're ready, uh, yeah. Uh, all right, on the Red Alliance, we have our number one seated Alliance captain, Team 10641, Atomic Gears. <laughs> and joining them on the Red Alliance, we have Team 12535, Revolutionary Robots. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have our number three seated Alliance cap, number four seated Alliance captain, Team 7506. System overload! System overload. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I thought I knew it. I just blanked. And joining them, we have Team 13049, the prototypes. I will do better next time, I promise. All right. Woo! Looks like we're ready. No, we're not ready. Ah. Haha. -ha. All right. Is everybody ready? Let's get this going in three, two, one, go. All right. The sounds are a little quiet, but we can work with that. Uh, we got a couple of high goals there for the Red Alliance. A couple of mid goals there for the Red Alliance as well. Two Red Alliance wobble goals in the correct zone. And amazingly, no power shots. A lot were fired in the direction of the power shots, but none of them hit. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Drivers, pick up your controller. Three, Three two, two, one. one. All right. Got to listen really close for those sounds there. They are happening. All right, we got robots driving around. One of the things that I really like in this match, that was like six high goals there or something. One of the things I really like in this match is all the different colors of mechanum wheels. There's three more high goals there for the Red Alliance. And we got a minute and a half remaining. 
Revolutionary Robots with a high goal for the Red Alliance. Looks like uh, several high goals there for the Blue Alliance and a couple for the Red Alliance. A mid goal there for the Blue Alliance. Two more high goals for the Red Alliance. 54 seconds remaining. Couple more high goals for the Red Alliance. And a couple more. Three high goals for Revolutionary Robots there. One, two, three high goals for the prototypes on the Blue Alliance. And one, two, high goals for the... <laughs> it is now the in-game period. Revolutionary Robots going after that first wobble goal. And we've got all of the robots going after. We got one power shot, two power shots. We got system overload with the blue wobble goals. And that is the match. That's three red power shots, two blue power shots. Very strong in game for both alliances. We need our semifinal two teams to the queuing area. All right, we got scores. A Red Alliance victory and a new high score for today, 278 to 133. Let's get some robots on the field for semifinal two, match number one.
All right. Let's meet our teams for semifinal two. On the Red Alliance, we have our second seeded Alliance captain, Team 6735, Team Medusa. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have Team 4378, Black Box. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have our third seeded Alliance captain, Team 14906, Leviathan. And Joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 7366, the Lab Rats. <laughs> All right, looks like we are randomized. Everything is ready. So let's get this match going in three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, we got robots moving around. That's one, two, three high goals for Team Medusa. And a two high goals for Black Box. We got one wobble goal in the right zone for each alliance. And nine seconds remaining in Autonomous. Leviathan moving over to park on the line. Driver, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. Bunch of rings going out onto the field. Team Medusa with the first high goal. Two high goals for Team Medusa. We got two more high goals for the Red Alliance. And a couple of mid goals for the Red Alliance as well. And a high goal there, the Lab Rats. Two more high goals, three more high goals for Team Medusa. Bunch of rings flying over on the blue side of the field. Leviathan with two mid goals for the Blue Alliance. And a high goal for the Red Alliance, Team Medusa. Forty-four seconds remaining. Black Box with two high goals. And it is now the game period. Leviathan going after their wobble goal. Black Box going after their wobble goal. Ooh, not quite able to make it over the wall. We got a couple of power shots scored for the Red Alliance, one for the Blue Alliance. And another power shot scored for the Blue Alliance. And that's a third power shot for the Red Alliance. Two Blue Alliance wobble goals over the wall. And that is the match.
We have scores. A Red Alliance victory, 232 to 131. Two nice palindrome scores there. All right, let's get semifinal one, match number two on the field. Are the prototypes coming? We are missing the prototypes. There's the prototypes. There they are. In semifinal one, match number two on the Red Alliance, we have Team 10 Sports on it, Atomic Gears. <laughs> Not sure what that microphone thing was. And joining them, we have Team 12 535 Revolutionary Robots. <laughs> Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 7506 System Overload. And joining them on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 13049, the Prototypes. <laughs> All right, are we randomized and ready to go? It looks like it. Let's get going in three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, Atomic Gears moving forward, System Overload moving forward. Atomic Gears with two high goals for the Red Alliance. And whoa, revolutionary robots, atomic gears. A little bit of a collision there. We got one blue high goal, or one blue wobble goal in the correct zone, one red wobble goal in the correct zone, and a little bit of a collision in the middle. Uh, that is the match. Driver, oh, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right. Robots in Motion, uh, Revolutionary Robots, and Atomic Gears getting those very quickly. They got two high goals and three more high goals from Revolutionary Robots. We got 
two high goals from Atomic Gears. System Overload getting lined up for some mid goals. And they got one for the Blue Alliance. And that's two, one, one high goal for the Red Alliance from Revolutionary Robots. Atomic Gears getting lined up. And they made one for the Red Alliance. System Overload going after those mid goals. Three high goals for Atomic Gears. And three more high goals for Atomic Gears. And that's a mid goal from System Overload. Another mid goal from System Overload for the Blue Alliance. And unfortunately, the prototypes seem to be disabled. Looks like three more high goals there for the Red Alliance. <laughs> and it is now the in-game period. That means we got one wobble goal from System Overload, one from Revolutionary Robots, and a second wobble goal from System Overload. We got one power shot, two power shots for the Red Alliance, and that's two wobble goals for each alliance. S five seconds remaining. Can we get any more power shots? <laughs> and the answer is no.
We have scores. Another Red Alliance victory, 88 to 250. Great job to prototypes and to System Overload for doing a great job today. And congratulations to Atomic Gears and Revolutionary Robots. You'll be moving on to the finals. All right, let's meet our teams once again for semifinal two. On the Red Alliance, we have Team 6735, Team Medusa. <laughs> and joining them on the Red Alliance, we have Team 4378, Black Box. <laughs> Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 14906, Leviathan. <laughs> And joining them, we have Team 7366, the Lab Rats. All right. Are we all ready to go? I think we are. Let's get this match going in three, two, one, go. All right. We got robots moving forward. Leviathan placing their wobble goal into the correct zone. One high goal for the Blue Alliance, two high, two maybe three high goals for the Red Alliance, two wobble goals in the correct zone for the Red Alliance, another high goal for the Blue Alliance, and we got a couple of robots on the line. Yeah, yeah, three robots on the line. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, robots are moving around. <laughs> Leviathan coming over to do some mid-goal shots. We're on the red side of the field. We got one high goal, three high goals, four high goals, 
for the Red Alliance and one mid goal for the Blue Alliance. Leviathan having issues getting rings out of their robot. <laughs> Team Medusa scoring a high goal. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. And Team Medusa shooting some more high goals. Black Box, whole bunch of high goals going in right there for the Red Alliance. Whoa. Hello. One off the top there for the Red Alliance. And three high goals there for Black Box. <laughs> and it's now the in game period. Black Box going after a Wobble goal. Are they disabled? Uh, we got Black Box going after a Wobble goal. Leviathan going after their Wobble goal. <laughs> Leviathan and Black Box both scoring a Wobble goal. Two wob two power shots have been scored for the Red Alliance. We have scores, a Red Alliance victory. That is 83 to 205. Great job today to Leviathan and the Lab Rats. You guys did an amazing. And congratulations to Team Medusa and to Black Box Robotics for advancing to the finals. And now we do have a five minute break before the next match. So, we're gonna go ahead and get started with some awards. Uh, we're just gonna kinda stick some awards in between each of these, so go ahead, grab your teams, get them in here. If you're working on your robot, that's fine. Um, you can keep doing that, but we're gonna go ahead and announce the first couple of awards for the competition. Actually, I'll wait until Ingrid is done meeting with them. All right. Hello, and welcome to the first part of the Oklahoma FTC Saturn League Tournament Hybrid Awards and Closing Ceremony, which will be interdispersed between the matches. Um, as many of you know, FIRST is a nonprofit and a global movement transforming lives and inspiring future innovators and problem solvers. I'll get you an award. Which one are you doing? Judges award. Judges that award. one doesn't have a trophy, though. Oh. Uh, so then, yeah, yeah. Uh, so 
Let's give a round of applause to our judges, referees, and field tech advisors for all their expertise, dedication, and hard work today. Because they, yeah, good job, guys. All right. So the first award that we're going to be giving out today is actually a judges award. The judges award is given at the discretion of the judges to a team they have encountered whose unique efforts, performance, or dynamics merit recognition, and yet the team does not fit any of the existing award categories. Here's what the judges have to say about the winner of this award. This rookie team demonstrated outstanding effort in their interviews, and the judges thought this team was deserving of the Rookie All-Star Award, and this award goes to team 18333 Void Elements. Uh, unfortunately, we do not have a trophy for you guys yet. We owe you a trophy. Uh, but we'll get you one soon. So yeah, good job, Void Elements. All right, our next award is the Design Award. This judged award recognizes design elements of the robot that are both functional and aesthetic. The design award is presented to teams that incorporate, incorporate industrial design elements into their solution. These design elements could simplify the robot's appearance by giving it a clean look, can be decorative in nature, or otherwise express the creativity of the team. The robot should be durable, efficiently designed, and effectively address the game challenge. Um, in second place, you'll just stand and we will cheer for you. Uh, we have Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. <laughs> and the winner of the design award is Team 7242 BC Robocats. <laughs> Come and get your trophy. And let's do one more. We're gonna do the Control Award, sponsored by Arm Inc. The Control Award celebrates a team that uses sensors and software to increase the robot's functionality in the field. This award is given to the team that demonstrates innovative thinking to solve game challenges such as autonomous operation, improving mechanical systems with intelligent control, or using sensors to achieve better results. The control component should work consistently in the field. In second place is team 16426 Absolute Zero. <laughs> and the winner of the Control Award, sponsored by Army Inc., is team 7506 System Overload. And that's all for our awards for now. We will be doing some more later, so stick around. And then we have a couple more minutes, and then we will get into finals match number one. Ah, uh, yes, if you want to come take a photo. Actually, we, I have a request for a photo for the, uh, for the finals matches teams, or just any teams. Any, any teams, if you want an award and you want to get a photo, you can come take a photo as a team over here.
probably should go ahead and start. Go ahead and start getting ready. Yeah, it's okay. okay. All right, okay. let's go ahead and start getting finals match one towards the field. You can go ahead and come set up for finals match number one. Finals match one, you guys ready? Looks looks like everybody's here. You guys can come set up on the field if you're ready. Yeah, come on. <laughs> We're waiting for you guys. All right, let's meet our teams for finals match number one over on the Red Alliance.
We have team. On the Red Alliance, we have team 10641 Atomic Gears. And joining them on the Red Alliance, we have team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. Over on the Blue Alliance, we have team 6735 Team Medusa. And joining them, we have team 4378 Black Box Robotics. All right, is everybody ready? Looks like it. Let's get this match going in three, two, one, go! All right. Black Box moving forward. Revolutionary Robots. The robot does sound like a cricket. They've got one high goal for the Blue Alliance, two high goals for the Blue Alliance, and a red wobble goal in the correct zone, and a blue wobble goal in the correct zone. And doesn't look like any power shots. Drivers, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots moving around. Revolutionary robots and atomic gears going after those rings. Team Medusa getting ready to shoot. Black Box going after those mid goals. They scored a high goal instead for the Red Alliance. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. Revolutionary Robots getting that wobble goal across so that they can score it. And a bunch of missed shots there. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. Black Box still lining up to shoot for a mid goal. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. And two high goals for the Red Alliance. And Team Medusa scoring another high goal for the Blue Alliance. Three more high goals for the Red Alliance. And one, two, three more high goals for the Red Alliance. Looks like Black Box playing some defense there. Revolutionary Robots going after the first wobble goal for the Red Alliance. And going after the second wobble goal as well. We got one blue power shot, one red power shot. Two red wobble goals, one blue wobble goal going over the wall right now, and a second red power shot. All three of the blue power shots, well, one of them descored. All right, very interesting.
we have scores. A Red Alliance victory, 141 to 228. I got a five minute timer started right here and I'm gonna do some more awards. All right, so the next award that we have is the Collins Aerospace Innovate Award. The Collins Aerospace Innovate Award celebrates a team that thinks outside of the box and has the ingenuity, creativity, and inventiveness to make their designs come to life. This judged award is given to the team that has the most innovative and creative uh, in robot sol design solution to any specific components in the first Tech Challenge game. Elements of this award include elegant design, robustness, and out-of-the-box thinking related to design. This award may address the design of the whole robot or of a sub-assembly attached to the robot. The creative component must work consistently, but a robot does not have to work all the time during the matches to be considered for this award. The winner of the Collins Aerospace Innovate Award is Team 4378 Black Box Robotics. Our next award is the Connect Award. Yeah, good job, Black Box. Woo. Our next award is the Connect Award. This judged award is given to the team that con most connects with their local science, technology, engineering, and math, STEM community. A true first team is more than a sum of its parts and recognizes that engages their local STEM community, always plays an essential part in their success. The recipient of this award is recognized for helping the community understand first the first tech challenge and the team itself. The team that wins the Connect Award actively seeks and recruits engineers and explores the opportunities available in the world of engineering, science, and technology. This team has a clear plan and has identified steps to achieve their goals. In second place is team 11344, the Merritt Oilers. And the winner of the Connect Award is Team 10641 Atomic Gears. <laughs> All right, and we'll do one more, and then we'll get back to the matches. This is the Think Award. This judged award is given to the team that best reflects the journey the team took as they experienced the engineering design process during the build season. The engineering content within the portfolio is a key reference for the judges to help identify the most deserving team. The team's engineering content must focus on the design and build stage of the team's robots. In second place is team 7242 BC RoboCats. And the winner of the Think Award is Team 6735, Team Medusa. <laughs> All right, I've got a minute and a half left on my clock. If you guys are ready, you can go ahead and start setting up on the field. But if you're not, you don't have to yet. Yeah, if you need to call a timeout, you can. All right, the Red Alliance has called a timeout.
Let's get robots to the field for finals match number two. In finals match number two, on the Red Alliance, we have Team 10641 Atomic Gears. <laughs> and joining them, we have Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. <laughs> Over on the Blue Alliance, we have Team 6735 Team Medusa. And joining them, we have Team 4378 Black Box. <laughs> All right, looks like we are randomized and ready to go. Let's get this match started in three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, Black Box moving forward. Revolutionary Robots moving forward. We got one wobble goal in the zone for the Red Alliance, Revolutionary Robots. And one wobble goal in the zone for the Blue Alliance. That second one might be in there. It's really close and hard to tell. And there's a power shot for the Red Alliance. Driver, pick up your controller. Three, two, one. All right, we got robots in motion. Lots of rings flying out onto the field. Revolutionary Robots getting a wobble goal across. And Black Box with a mid goal for the Blue Alliance. Revolutionary Robots with two high goals. And Atomic Gears with three high goals for the Red Alliance. And Team Medusa with a high goal for the Blue Alliance. We got one mid goal for Black Box Robots, Robotics, and a couple of high goals for the Red Alliance. Three more high goals from Revolutionary Robots, and three more high goals from Team Medusa. Two high goals for the Red Alliance. Two more high goals for the Red Alliance, Revolutionary Robots. One minute remaining in the match. Revolutionary Robots and Atomic Gears both firing at that high goal. They made a few of them. Team Medusa firing and making one in the high goal. And they got a couple more 
with black box there for the blue alliance. Almost the in-game period. <laughs> Somebody seems to have lost a part on the field. Revolutionary Robots with a first wobble goal for the Red Alliance, going after the second one. And Black Box with the first wobble goal for the Blue Alliance. We got a couple of power shots over here for the Blue Alliance, one for the Red Alliance, a second for the Red Alliance. So close, and there's a third power shot for the Red Alliance. Are you guys ready to find out the scores for finals match number two? That's okay. Who thinks, who thinks that the Blue Alliance won and will force a tiebreaker? Anyone? Yeah! Mr. Sullivan thinks that there'll be a tiebreaker. Uh, well, I guess we'll find out. Yeah, let's find out. We got scores. A Red Alliance victory. 163 to 228. Good job to the Blue Alliance, Black Box, and Medusa. You guys played a great day. And congratulations to our winning alliance. Uh, we're going to take down the field real quick. And then we have, obviously, a couple awards left. Inspire Award most notably.
losing the word dumb. All right, we got just a little bit of tape left on the floor. And then we're going to start up our final award ceremony. Yeah, if your team isn't in here, go ahead and grab them. We're going to go ahead and get started with our awards. No. All right. So, up first, we are going to uh, we are going to honor our finalist alliance, which is Team Medusa and Black Box. Please come forward and receive your trophies. Is Black Box here? Yeah, Black Box, get in here. We got a trophy for you. Finalist alliance, good job, well done. Very nice, excellent. And up next, we are going to uh, celebrate our winning alliance, which is, as you know, uh, Atomic Gears and Revolutionary Robots. Please come receive your trophies. Very cool, job well done. All right. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, the Inspire Award. Yeah! This judged award is given to the team that best embodies the challenge of the First Tech Challenge program. The team that receives this award is a strong ambassador for First Teams and a role model First Team. This, this team is a top contender for many other judged awards and is a gracious competitor. The Inspire Award winner is an inspiration to other teams acting with gracious professionalism both on and off the playing field. This team shares their experiences, enthusiasm, and knowledge with other team sponsors, uh, their community, and the judges. Working as a unit, this team will have showed success in performing the task of designing and building a robot. In third place, you can stand and we will recognize you. We have team 7506 System Overload. In second place, we have team 10641 Atomic Gears. And the winner of the Inspire Award is Team 12535 Revolutionary Robots. We have a trophy for you. Yes. We also have medals. Yes. Yeah, Atomic Gears, come get some medals at some point as well. Go talk to Travis later. Uh, but thank you all for being a great audience today and for helping to support the next generation of leaders and innovators for bringing your gracious professionalism to the competition. Remember, your participation with the First Tech Challenge program doesn't have to end here. Check out their website for opportunities to volunteer at one of the First Lego League Junior, First Lego League, First Robotics Competition, and of course, First Tech Challenge programs. And make sure to uh, learn more about scholarships, internships, and alumni opportunities at firstinspires.org slash alumni. Finally, a big thank you to everyone. We had an excellent event and look forward to seeing you next year. Now, uh, you probably also want to know who made it to state. So I'm going to hand it off to Travis to do that.
Right. Thank you, Tyler. Thank you to all the volunteers here today. Give them a big hand because they're awesome. And thank you to Newcastle High School for hosting us. And thanks to all our, our judges who have been slaving away behind their computer screens, uh, trying to help make decisions and, and things like that. You've been very impressive to all of them, the fact that you were able to build a robot this year. So I do have the state advancement list. Uh, Five teams will advance from this particular event. Um, there's a small chance we might add a sixth one later, but we need to play out the rest of the events so the math works out, we'll see. So our Inspire Award winner advances, uh, one, two, five, three, five, Revolutionary Robots. <laughs> Second advancement spot goes to our winning Alliance captain, uh, 10641 Atomic Gears. <laughs> and then, uh, Inspire Award second place and Winning Alliance first team are the, actually the same two teams, so we move on to the Inspire Award third place winner, who is 7506 System Overload. <laughs> then our Think Award winner, 6735, I believe that's Medusa. <laughs> All right, then we have our finalist, Captain and Connect Award winner who have already advanced, and then our finalist Alliance first team selected is number team number five. It's four three seven eight, <laughs> which I believe is Black Box, right? So, congratulations! Uh, and then we have an our alternate in the event things work out weirdly in the next week or two with math is our Design Award winner Bridge Creek. So. And if you did not advance to state, you have one more chance, by the way. We have something called the Last Chance Qualifier, and it's a remote qualifier, and I would encourage everybody who competed today uh, who did not advance to state already to go to that one, because we're going to be giving away probably another four advancement slots, uh, three or four advancement slots at that one. And if you did well today and were close or whatever, you start with, like, Every, everyone's going to start from ground zero on that one. None of, you, one of, none of what you've done up to now counts. So you get that reset to start with a score of zero, run your remote matches, do your remote judging at the end of it, and then we'll, have, we'll pick some winners out of that one. So that'll be pretty exciting, actually. That's something we've not done before, but I think it'll be a nice little added touch, another chance for teams to uh, advance the state. So good luck and congratulations, everybody. Uh, great job today. Have a good one. See you guys later.